This is Captain Andrew, your voice of Jersey Cape Fishing, here this morning with your Marine and Fishing Report, brought to you today by the Saltwater Outpost at Hereford Marina at the Sunset Pier in Sea Isle City. Today I'm going to do something different and talk about returning fisheries that have once been depleted but are now rebounding in our county, and how you can fish for them. In the upper end of the county, red drum are being encountered. New Jersey was once known as the red drum capital of the world in the 1910s and 1920s, especially around the Corson's Inlet area and the Great Egg Harbor, but the fishery was decimated because of no management. In the last 10 years, though, the population has been slowly reappearing, and this does include some major sized fish. You can find red drum offshore, but they are more prevalent in the back bays. Hit them with the same surface plugs you would use to target sh large stripers. Now, when you are done fishing, be sure to dock up at the Sunset Pier in Sea Isle City, located on 86th and the Bay, to get yourself a great meal. Sunset Pier offers breakfast, lunch, and dinner daily, and be sure to ask them how to reserve your very own Townsend's Inlet Sunset Tour. Now, in Wildwood and Stone Harbor, a secret king of the back bays has lost its mystique. The bridges, rocks, and seawalls are alive with sheep's head, some of these fish surpassing 15 plus pounds. I first saw one caught in 2001 on a party boat near Cold Spring Inlet, but now many anglers find success at slack tide with fresh crab bait on a hard structure, both in the back bays and out on the ocean. Contact a local tackle shop to discuss strategy for catching sheep's head and be ready for one heck of a great fight on light tackle. Now while you're in the Wildwoods, stop at the Saltwater Outpost at Hereford Marina on Ash Avenue in North Wildwood for all of your fishing needs. They're open daily, 7 a.m. to 3 p.m., or you can call them at 609-854-3806. Now finally, Cape May has been a long-time hotspot for offshore fishing, but in recent years there has been so much of an explosion in the returning cobia fishery that many tackle shops now stock live eels all summer long. Cobia are large game fish, but they are a bit of a finicky eater, and they fight like a shark but taste even better. Live bait is key for this oceanic species, so be ready for a once-in-a-lifetime New Jersey fishing experience when you hook one. That is all I have for you today. Tune in every Wednesday and Friday morning at 8.35 a.m. And if you would like to sponsor this fine radio broadcast, call our sales department at 609-522-1987, extension 105. Have a great day, tight lines, and good fishing.